Hey folks, I've got another short and sweet tutorial for all of you today. If you've ever tried to delete messages on Facebook, you're probably aware they don't exactly make it easy. In fact, if it weren't for the app that I'm about to show you how to use, you would literally need to delete them one by one. And trust me, that process is painful and will age you faster than a winter on Cape Cod. That's why today I'm gonna to show you a little trick to do it a lot faster. Coming up next on Tech Talk America. Hey folks, and welcome to the class. If you want to delete your old Facebook messages, you know, because Facebook has such a great reputation of respecting your privacy, you can either delete those messages manually, one by one, or there is a free plugin that works only with Google Chrome, appropriately named Delete All Messages for Facebook. I have a link to that extension down below in the video description, and like I said, it's totally free. To show you how to use this browser extension, let's now switch to my Mac. I'm going to apologize in advance because due to fairly obvious reasons, I'm going to have to end up blurring a lot of my screen for this recording. After you've installed the Delete All Messages extension into Google Chrome, you should see it appear here at the top right of your browser. From here, we'll just need to log into Facebook and then go into Facebook Messenger. Now, if you actually want to delete all of your past messages, and remember, there is no recovering that data, you can then just click that icon again and select delete all messages. That being said, if you only want to select some of the messages, there are two ways that you can potentially approach this. You can either select all the messages and then uncheck the ones that you want to keep, or you can do the reverse and just individually check the ones that you want to remove. If you want to go the route of selecting everything and then unchecking the ones that you want to keep, you will first need to scroll all the way to the bottom of this left-hand column. And depending on how long you've been using Facebook, this could take a while. I'm going to speed up this part in editing because when I went to do this for myself, I am not joking, it took a full eight minutes of continuous scrolling before I finally hit the bottom of the list. So once you get to the bottom, you can then click the icon at the top right and select Choose and Delete. You will now see boxes appear next to each conversation, and if we scroll back to the top, you will now see that we have an option to select all. So at this point, you can determine which approach is best for you. When you're done, you're gonna click this green button here at the top center of the screen. Last thing before we go, while you're still on Facebook, I hope you'll take a quick moment to like Tech Talk America's page. And if you're into feel good content, be sure to check out my other project called Droning Provincetown, which involves my turning real life situations that only happen in Provincetown into musical montages through the magic of video editing. Thank you so much for watching everyone. If this video helped you, please take a quick moment and hit that little thumbs up like button. Leave me a comment down below. And if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and make sure you hit that little bell icon for notifications. This is David A. Cox with Tech Talk America, class dismissed.